U.S. Army's Rapid Capabilities and Critical Technologies Office, RCCTO, has announced an exclusive contract with BAE Systems to develop a cutting-edge 155mm self-propelled artillery system, the Multi-Domain Artillery Cannon, MDAC. This new system is specifically designed to address the growing aerial threats of today, including drones, cruise missiles, and advanced aircraft. With an operational demonstration plan for 2028, the MDAC aims to provide the U.S. Army with a state-of-the-art air defense solution. The MDAC will be able to protect both fixed and semi-fixed positions against a wide range of threats. These include armed drones, helicopters, fixed-wing aircraft, and cruise missiles, all of which are becoming increasingly common on modern battlefields. The cannon will complement existing air defense systems in a layered defense strategy, enabling a more effective response to these rapidly evolving threats. One of the standout features of the MDAC is its use of hypervelocity projectiles, HVP which were originally developed for the U.S. Navy's now-canceled electromagnetic railgun program. These projectiles can travel at speeds exceeding 9,000 km per hour, offering a kinetic impact that destroys targets with unparalleled speed and force. HVPs are also a much more cost-effective alternative to traditional missile systems, with a price tag of under $100,000 per round, compared to millions of dollars for systems like the Stinger missile. The development of the MDAC is being fast-tracked thanks to the use of an Other Transaction Agreement, OTA, a contract mechanism that bypasses traditional bureaucratic hurdles and accelerates technology development. The project is a collaboration between the U.S. Army, the Air Force, and other key defense entities, including the Pentagon Strategic Capabilities Office and the Air Force Research Laboratory. The aim is to finalize a complete prototype by the end of fiscal year 2027 which will include a full artillery battery with multiple MDAC cannons, radars, and battle managers. Key technical features of the MDAC include a high rate of fire, significant ammunition capacity, and the ability to rapidly resupply, whether manually or automatically. The system will also be transportable by C-130 aircraft, making it an ideal asset for rapid deployment in expeditionary missions. Although the specifics of the DAX design remain confidential, it is expected that BAE Systems will draw inspiration from its Archer self-propelled howitzer. The Archer, developed by Bofors, a BAE subsidiary, features a quick-response autoloader and the ability to reposition rapidly after firing. The MDAC could use a similar chassis, possibly based on the widely used FMTV tactical trucks, to meet the unique demands of this advanced artillery platform. The hypervelocity projectiles at the heart of the MDC project offer a solution to modern aerial threats, with a range of about 31 kilometers for the 155 mm cannon. These projectiles will be available in both kinetic and explosive variants, providing a versatile response to a wide array of targets. The development of the MDAC is timely, as modern aerial threats, such as armed drones and cruise missiles, are becoming more widespread and sophisticated. The ongoing war in Ukraine has highlighted the need for innovative and cost-effective solutions to counter these emerging threats, and the MDAC is poised to deliver just that. However, the MDAC is not intended to be a standalone solution. It will work as part of a broader integrated defense network, coordinating with other air defense platforms like the Integrated Air and Missile Defense Battle Command System, IBCS. This multi-layered defense approach will be crucial in addressing complex and diverse aerial threats effectively. The MDAX development is also occurring amid ongoing discussions between the U.S. Army and Air Force about air defense responsibilities. The Air Force has shown interest in taking on certain roles traditionally handled by the Army, citing the need to adapt to the changing nature of modern warfare. The MDAC is set to become a critical asset in layered defense strategies, offering a flexible, cost-effective response to contemporary aerial threats. By combining rapid prototyping, innovative technology, and cost-effective solutions, the MDAC will play a crucial role in modernizing the U.S. Army's defense capabilities. It is a powerful step toward ensuring that the U.S. military can effectively respond to the challenges of the future battlefield. As the Army continues to refine and finalize the MDC, it's clear that this project will shape the future of military defense, providing a dynamic and efficient solution to the increasingly complex threats facing the modern world.